Hurry up and review me movie, for I rip off your head and shove it up me ass. I'll re I'm gonna review it now, just calm down. Well hurry up, asshole. Alright, I'm reviewing it now. What's up everyone, I'm Becky Johnson, another video now for this one, of course, I'm continuing my Leprechaun review series. For this one, of course, I am reviewing Leprechaun 4 in space. Now, um... Now, this one is kind of, like, this one ain't horrible, horrible. You know, I'm kind of split on this one. I think it's okay. You know, um, I think it's okay, you know. I like the, I actually like it better than part two, because part two I'm not a huge fan of. But, yeah, um, never gone for in space, you know. I just got done with watching it, for, like, because it's been, it's been a long time since I watched this one. And, um, this one is not that horrible. You know, there's all good things about it, and there's also a lot of bad things about it. Now, let's start with the good. Now, um, the characters in this film were fun. You know, just like the third one. The characters in the third one were fun. This one, the characters are fun. And, and there's, and people are freaking funny in this movie. You know, there's some funny scenes in this movie that'll make you laugh. And then there's some creative kills here and there, you know. In these movies, there's not a lot of bloody, bloody kills, you know. But they're still done creatively. You know, Leprechaun Returns has a lot of blood. And that's probably, like, the goriest one. That's why that one's going to... You can see that one higher up on the list, Leprechaun Returns. You can see that one higher up on the list when I do the ranking. Um, but I don't want to spoil the ranking, you know. Um, but, but Leprechaun 4 in space. Um, this one is pretty interesting. You know, um, the characters are likable. Um, the story's okay, you know, because if you're going to do a few Leprechaun movies, eventually you got to do something a little different. And each Leprechaun movie does sort of do something a little different because, you know, they do different things, sort of. And what's crazy is none of these are pretty much sequels. These are their own movies each time. That's what's special about these. And plus, I love the soundtrack in um, Leprechaun 4. I love the soundtrack of it too. The soundtrack was pretty damn good and stuff. Now we're going to get to the bad. Mm. So, the, the main negative I have with this movie was the CGI at the end of the film. Where, when Leprechaun started getting bigger and he started becoming a giant. You know, Leprechaun 4 and Jason X are sort of alike, except Jason X I think is a little bit better than Leprechaun 4. But, um, Leprechaun 4. Is a decent movie in my opinion. You know, I don't think it's that bad of a movie, in my opinion. Um, you never saw Leprechaun in Space. You know, one, two, and three. So they said, you know what, we're going to try to bring Leprechaun in Space for once. And um, and sometimes it can work. Sometimes it can't. You know, if it's in space, you know you got to turn your brain off and just enjoy for what it is. But you know, the um bad thing is, I didn't like the um CGI at the end. See, people complained about um. The CGI and the two it remakes, even though they enjoyed them, a lot of people loved them, but some people still complained about the CGI. Um, and and they need to start looking back at Leprechaun Four. That CGI at the end of the film was bad CGI. I know this movie got made in like 1997, but if you think about, it, look at the original Child's Play. You know, the um, animatronics, everything behind that movie was good, but like. Never come forward to CGI at the end of this film wasn't great. And then plus they killed him off in a lazy way at the end. Um and stuff. So yeah, th this film I'm split on this, you know. Um I'm kind of split on this one. You know, sometimes, you know, like it's kind of in the middle for me. Um in this film, you know, I don't hate it. I could I could probably watch it again. But, you know, Leprechaun 4 in space just ain't the best, you know. And ain't the best one, of course. Um, but I do think it's sort of fun. And, by the way, Leprechaun's an asshole in this one. <laughs> He's a straight-up dick in this movie. Probably more than the, probably more than all the other movies. He In this one, he's the most asshole in this one. Even though he's the asshole in all of them, he's the most asshole in this one. So, yeah, Leprechaun 4 in space... If I had to rate this film, I would probably give this. And the acting ain't phenomenal. You know, some people in the film 
acting's better than other people, but you know, um, but some of these characters are still fun, you know. So if I had to rate this film, I would give it an eight out of ten. Eight out of ten is actually a good score, you know. And I feel like Leprechaun Four is better than what a lot of people give it credit for, because um, Leprechaun Four ain't that bad, you know. And I said it before, I'm not the biggest Leprechaun fan. I really ain't like. I really ain't the biggest Leprechaun fan, and, um, because, like, when I was young, I used to love the Leprechaun to death. He used to be my favorite horror icon when I was a little kid, but when I go back and rewatch him, they ain't as good as I remember him to be, but there are some that's really good, and I really enjoy Leprechaun Returns, and I don't want to spoil my ranking. It's out there. I'm not going to say where, but it's out there, and I don't want to spoil that ranking. I hope y'all look forward. I hope y'all are looking forward to my um Leprechaun movie ranking because it could be fun. Now Leprechaun Four in Space, it's an eight out of ten for me. Um, I enjoy the film. It's not perfect. There are um a, a, quite a few negatives in this film, but it will take a, me a it would make a long long video, and I'm not trying to make this video too long. But it'll take me a long video if I just talk about all this negatives I have in it. There are quite a few negatives in this film. Um, but yeah, um, but I just said a few negatives. But yeah, um, Leprechaun 4 in space, it's 8 out of 10 for me. Um, it's 8 out of 10, so yeah. Leprechaun in space. Now, I've heard a lot of people hate this movie. Just because Leprechaun took place in space. You know, if you could do something different, like I said before, you gotta do something to keep the franchise going. And that's what they did with Jason. That's also what they did with this one. They had the, and then plus, you know, Leprechaun ended up going in the hood. And then there's a part two The Leprechaun goes to the hood. You know, there's just, he goes in different places. And um, that's what they should do if you're gonna do something different. And that's exactly what, um... That's exactly what Jason did too, because they've done a lot of the same things throughout the movies. That they said, you know what, we gotta do something different when Jason goes to hell, and they also we also gotta do something different with Jason X, and then and then we also gotta do something different with Freddy vs. Jason, which is, you know, it wasn't think about doing nothing different in that movie. They just said it's bring two iconic horror characters and put them in one movie and let them face off and let put some gore kills in there in once in a while. That's what they did with freaking um, that movie. Um, Freddy vs. Jason, but yeah, they did something different a lot of times in Jason movies, except the first eight. But the first eight was kind of the same thing a little bit. You know, part four was the best one in the um in the for Friday the Thirteenth movies, but in my opinion. So yeah, if you haven't checked out my review series for the Friday the Thirteenth movies, please check that out. That was a fun series. And also, if you haven't checked out my um review series for the Child's Play franchise, please check that out. And also, if y'all um. If you haven't checked out my review series for the Halloween franchise, please check that out. So, yeah, I got a lot of those on my channel. So, yeah. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I guess that's it for this video. Hope you enjoyed this um, review. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button. And please subscribe and share. And also hit the bell so you know when a new video is uploaded. Peace out. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'm out. Peace.